Hello and welcome. I am Lisa, the Queen of Support here at Post Point of Sale. Today I'm going to give you a brief rundown on the reports section. To access the reports, you're going to want to log in to your Post Management System and click the Reports tab. Underneath the Reports tab, you will find three other tabs, Sales Report, Z Report Archive, and Gift Cards. The one you're going to spend the most time in is probably the Sales Report section. This is, gives you all the breakdowns that you will need. First thing you're going to want to do is filter your reports. If you click the drop down here, you can filter by a specific date or date range. In addition, you can filter by cash register. You can also filter by a category, items, and suppliers as well. Scrolling down, you will find your net sales, estimated gross profit, payment types, number of transactions, and number of units returned. Scroll down a little further and you will see two tabs, Units Sold and Receipts. Receipts tab will give you a breakdown on all of your receipts. You can click View for a screenshot of a receipt. Here is an example. This is the same receipt that your customer receives. You can click the Units Sold tab to give you a breakdown on all of your units that were sold. Both of these can be exported into an Excel format. Scroll back up to the top, click the Z Report Archive, and this will give you a breakdown of all your Z Reports. Your Z Reports are your end of the day reports that are emailed to you when you close your register at night. You can view these reports, and you can also export them into Excel as well. Here is an example of one such report. As you can see, it gives you the same breakdown as the report section total value of transactions, total number of transactions, and if you scroll down, you'll see the different types of payments and units sold. The gift cards reports is where all of your gift cards are stored. Here you have outstanding gift cards, however you can filter them however you like. Down at the bottom, you will see that this report, this gift card, excuse me, for David, was issued on December 22nd, 2016, and it expires December 22nd, 2017. It also tells you the date that it was last used, the gift card number, and the current balance. Gift cards that have not been redeemed will not have a name assigned to them. Reports can also be downloaded into an Excel, just like the other reports as well. I hope that gives you some good information, and if you have any questions, please feel free to email us at support at getpost.com. Thanks so much.